Uh, welcome to Living Life with Purpose. I'm your host, Phil Foster. Well, today's Friday, and I just want to take just a minute to remind you to get out to church somewhere this weekend. I know Easter was last weekend, but you know you can go to church more than just on Easter Sunday. And so, uh, if you're in the Athens area, we'd love to have you here at New Life. This Sunday at the end of the service, we'll be taking uh, communion, and I know in the different traditions within the Protestant or Roman Catholic, there's different views that are held on that, but so I'm not going to try to get into all that, but you know, in 1 Corinthians 11, Paul talks about uh, communion there, and there's a couple things that we're supposed to do there. Paul admonishes us, and I'm going to cover them real fast. Uh, the first is we're to look back. When we look back, we're reminded uh, what Jesus Christ did on the cross and what he did with his bodily, physical resurrection, so we're reminded that we don't just celebrate his resurrection on Easter, but every Sunday technically we celebrate his resurrection and through communion we remember his body that was broken and his blood that was shed. Paul also told, told us to examine ourselves. He says to look within and if you have your harbor and things like unforgiveness or something like that, uh, the Lord wants us to get rid of that at, and lay it at the altar before you take communion. And then he wants us to look around. And remember, you're part of the body. It's not just, uh, you're not supposed to be the Lone Ranger. We're all in this together. And the last thing is we want to look ahead. And we're to be reminded that one day we're going to have a, a, a homecoming with Jesus Christ. And we're going to get to spend eternity with him. So there's a lot I could say, but I'm going to cut short. Get out to church this weekend until we get together on Monday. May God bless you. And hey, have a great day.